I'll pick the paper. I already have a lot of gold at home. Girl, why did you choose the paper? Let me choose what I want. You'd rather choose the paper than 10 kilograms of gold? The paper's folded. Open it and see what it is. Don't open it. So what's this paper gonna do? Why do you always carry this paper everywhere? Oh, it's just to make sure no one opens it. So you still don't know what's inside the paper? <sighs> I'll open it when I'm ready. You're weird. This paper must contain answers. That's why your scores are always high. I don't need to cheat to get high scores. It's called studying. And this paper can't be opened up until I grow up. So open it now. You're an adult. If that paper isn't a cheat sheet, open it now. See, even the teacher thinks that. So now you have to open okay, it. Okay, I'll open it. Now you have to open it. Okay, I'll open it. What's on the paper? It's definitely answers for the test. Tell me what's in the paper. If you don't tell me, I'm going to have to expel you from the school. I'm sorry. I can't tell you. Like the teacher said, if you don't tell us, you're getting expelled. That's fine. I'd rather leave the school than tell you what's in this paper. Good thing they didn't see what's written in here. I know you will be confused, but soon you'll find out. Do not tell anyone what's written in this letter. Ryan. But who's Ryan? Mom, I just opened the letter I picked when I was little, but there's a person's name on it. You have to find out who wrote you the note, because it's... I'll get it. Hello? You've been accepted to your new Seriously? school. Seriously? But that paper you're holding, don't let anyone see what's written in it. Sure. How does he know what's written in it? Maybe it's him. What's your name? Ten million or a pen? Of course the money. Amara, don't forget breakfast. <sighs> yes, mom. I chose it by accident. This pen is so ugly. They could have at least given me a nice one. I'll just use it until it runs out. Honey, what did you choose? <sighs> I chose the pen. Instead of the money, what are you going to do <sighs> with Whatever, it? Whatever, mom. It was your fault I chose the pen anyway. Hey, don't blame me for your actions. <sighs> What did you choose? The money, right? No, I chose a pen. Oh my gosh, that pen is so old. We all chose the money. Look, the poor person just entered our class. She's dumb for choosing the pen. I know, right? I can't help but laugh at her. Class, I hope you're all ready for the test. Huh? Sir, can you repeat that? There's only going to be two questions, but they're going to be super hard. I didn't even study. I don't understand any of this. I'll just answer it. Jake, since you finished first, you're getting extra points. I don't care about who finishes first. I care about getting the highest grade. It's really upsetting that I don't have any friends. Let me just use this pen. Amara will disappear from this world. Did you hear the news about Amara? Yeah, she disappeared. No one knows where she is. Are they talking about me? That means this pen is smart pill or power pill. I want to be smart. Mom, I'm going to school. I have a really important test today. Why do you even bother going? Everyone in this family failed because we're not very academic. Going to these tests are a waste of time. Bye. No buts. Next semester, make sure you pay for your own course because I'm not paying for it anymore. It's useless. Hey. Oh my gosh, look who it is. Why do you even bother coming to school? You keep getting low grades in every exam. Stop wasting your parents' money and just quit. Well, I've been studying and I have a good feeling about this exam. Oh, I almost feel bad for you. I actually think you're going to pass. Whatever, I'll show you. You have one hour to complete the test. No cheating, please. She's definitely going to fail. I don't even know why she bothers. Well, what they don't know is that I've taken the smart pill, so there's no way I could fail. Amara, is this your paper? Yeah. You got 100 out of 100. Well done. Sir, she brought a cheat book with her. Is that true, Amara? Answer truthfully. In that case, I'm giving you two biology questions to Wait, answer. Wait, like right now? Yes, right now. Whoever has the highest grade gets a prize. And the one with the lowest grade will be suspended. Good luck at failing, Amara. <laughs> Whoever has the highest grade gets a prize. Whoever has the lowest gets suspended. Good luck at failing, Amara. You only have 60 minutes. Make sure you answer all the questions. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. This test is so easy. There's five minutes remaining. Hurry up. Done, sir. I'm also done. I'm sure I got all the questions right. Look, isn't that Amara? Yeah, she's so brave for challenging Gemma. Isn't she in, like, rank one? Let's see what you all have to say after I win. Better say goodbye to the school, Amara. I can't wait to see your face after the results come out. And what if I win? That's not possible. My whole family is filled with doctors and lawyers. And what's yours? Both your parents are cleaners. I'm surprised they're still paying for your course. 
I'm sure I'm gonna win, right? We'll find out later. The results are in. Please come and see what your scores are. Who won? It was me, right, sir? Look at how ugly I am. Of course I'm gonna pick the beauty pill. Is that her, the ugliest girl in school? Yeah, that's her. What do you mean? Why is my beauty pill not working? Class, we all know there will be a contest for prom princess. Who's signing up? Sir, I'd like to sign up. Why would you sign up? You look like Shrek's daughter. I didn't just sign up. I'm also going to win and be the prom princess. Don't make me laugh. Let's bet on it. All right, let's do it. Whoever loses the bet needs to leave the school forever. Deal. The pill needs to load quick. Prom is about to start. Finally, it's time. Three, two, one. Oh my gosh, it looks like I'm a total different person. I look so good. I can't believe it. Is that Amara? Whoa, she's beautiful. Hey, so I bet it's still on, right? Wait, why do you look so good? <laughs> you think you're the only one that took the beauty pill? I don't care about the pill. I'm still going to win the bet. And you're going to leave the school. Amara and Olivia, please come up on stage. You're both finals in the Princess Prom Contest. Better start looking for other schools. We'll see about that. And the prom princess is... Please be me. Please be me. Olivia. What? How? I can't believe this. Um, choose between the white bottle or the gold bottle. I choose the gold one. I wonder what power this one's going to give me. I disappear when I hold my breath. Interesting. Mom, I... Honey, can you go to the shop for me and buy some vegetables? Amara, where did she go? Yes, she can't see me. <gasps> Finally, I can breathe again. What power did you get? I can disappear when I hold my breath. Oh, cool. Every time I sneeze, I fly. Why are you talking to Jason? He's so weird. Weird? What do you mean? He doesn't let anyone go to his house because he says his mom is fat. But his mom is fine. But Jason seems pretty normal to me. I have to prove it myself. Jason, I'm coming to your house later. No! What? Why? You don't want anything bad to happen, do you? Anything bad to happen? I have to disappear and enter Jason's home. Hmm. I've always wondered. Seriously? 10,000 for these? They're not even branded. I don't know what I'm feeling coming. So, did you choose 10,000 like we agreed on? No, I chose the glasses. What? Why? I don't know. Maybe they have a superpower or something. So, do they? You used to be a stripper? What? How did you know that? Hey, I won't judge. Hmm. So, these glasses reveal people's secrets. Interesting. Sis! What do you want? Just stay right there. Mom? I really want to have a baby sister. Honey, you chose the money like we agreed, I right? chose to have a little sister. What? What's your problem? Why would you even do that? Taking care of you is hard enough. Hey, take care of your sister while I go to the market. Okay, mom. Just wait for me here real quick, okay? I'm just going to the bathroom. Okay. Where is she? I told you to take care of your sister while I went to the market. You left her all alone. If you can't take care of her, why did you choose to have a sister? I just went to the bathroom. Because of that, she got hit by a car. You're so irresponsible. Why would you leave your sister all alone? You shouldn't have done that. I only left her for a minute. I needed to use the bathroom. I didn't know this was going to happen. Don't excuse yourself. You went the wrong. I'm sorry. My parents were right. I'm not a good sister. Because you were careless and almost killed your sister. You're not eating today. It was you who chose to have a sister, and when it comes to taking care of her, you don't want to. Since my parents never wanted to have her, it's better she never existed. <sighs> one million or a crown? Of course the one million. What? Why? <sighs> this crown is so strange. It doesn't even fit. Why did everyone buy a new car? Because everyone chose the one million. Life is so unfair. Hey mom, I'm home. Hey honey, you chose the money, right? Yes, of course. Attention students, tomorrow there'll be a costume party at school. Everyone's supposed to wear a costume. But I don't have a costume. 
I only have this crown and this dress. The only thing I can dress as is a princess. Okay, it doesn't look that bad. Mom, can you take me to school? Yes, of course I can, Your Majesty. You don't even have to ask. Hello, everyone. Your Majesty, what are you doing here? What do you mean by that? Our Queen is here. Everyone kneel down. Cause of death? What does that mean? It means you can see when people die, but don't pay too much attention to it. You're still too young to understand. It says you're gonna die of old age. I said don't look at it. Okay, sorry. Yummy, milkshake. Don't drink that milkshake! Why not? I love milk- <coughs> I told you! Amara, I finally got my driving license after working so hard to get You shouldn't it. drive! What? Why not? Just trust me! Can you please tell me how I'm gonna die? You're gonna get poisoned. Wait, what? Yeah, I'd be careful with what I eat if I were you. My stepmom made me this lunch. Do you think she's trying to poison me? Hey, bestie. Where have you been? You didn't come to class this morning. Don't tell anyone. I ditched class to be with my new boyfriend. You have a boyfriend? Amara, meet Michael. Hey. Can I speak to you in private, like, now? I have to choose between going to the bowels of the earth or the end of the earth. Mom, which one's safer? Honey, I recommend going to the bowels of the earth. Don't go to the end of the earth. There's many wild animals there. The bowels of the earth? Since no one's ever been there before, I'll be the first. I can't wait for my trip to the bowels of the earth. It's only 24 hours away. Wait, what did you say? Bowels of the earth? Yes, why? It's very hot there. There's no way you could survive. You'll die as soon as you get there. How do you know? No one's ever been there. Oh yeah, right. I'll look for more information about it because you're my friend. I don't want anything bad happening to you. Whoa, you said you were going to the bowels of the earth. That's so cool. Yeah, that's right. I'll be the first person to go there. At the same time, you'll be the first person to die there. <laughs> Honey, you have to bring these things with you. I prepared a bag. What's in the bag, Mom? Just take it with you. Don't open it until you get to your final destination. You're sure it's safe to go there, right? Yes, it's very safe. Don't worry. Here, for you, Amara. What is this? Death flowers. Guys, come on. I'll be fine. Let us know later if you're still alive. <sighs> Whatever. Honey, did you forget I'm allergic to flowers? Who gave them to you? <sighs> My friends, Mom. They're making fun of me because I want to go to the bowels of the earth. If so, throw them away. <sighs> it's probably them. They're here to make fun of me again. Oh, hey, babe. Why didn't you tell me you were coming? We have to break up. What? Why? I can't be with you. You chose the bowels of the earth. <sighs> Why don't you come with me? We can get married there. What are you saying? Nothing can survive in the bowels of the earth. I'm going to have to find another girl. Amara, I found information about your trip. You actually went to find it? Yes, it says there's a city that only certain people can enter. And what are these certain people like? Because yesterday you chose the bowels of the earth, you're not one of those people. Whoa, does that mean I'm a special child now? Goodbye, Amara. Good luck in heaven. Rest in peace, Amara. People don't know that there's a city there. I'll prove to them that I can survive. Hey, when you go to the bowels of the earth, can I come with you? Who are you? Little kids can't come. I've been there many times. What? Yes, every week I always go to the bowels of the earth. That's a lot of flowers. <sighs> yeah, they're from my friends. Oh, look, I only have a few seconds left before I leave. Three, two, one. Excuse me, do you know where... Do you have an access card? Access card? Yes, show me it right now. I'm sorry, but um, I don't have an access card. Only people with an access card can get in here. Please give me some time to go back and find it. Okay, I'll give you an hour. Huh? Only an hour? I mean, thank you, sir. I knew she was too scared to go to the bowels of the earth. Yeah, what do you think? No one dares to go there. Not everybody can. Only special people can go there. Mom, how come you're not at the bowels of the earth? I didn't have an access card. Why are you like this? Didn't I tell you to take this bag with you? I must have dropped it. Good thing they gave me another chance to come and get it. You should be able to take care of yourself there. I will, Mom. Please show me your access card. Here you go. Please come in. Welcome to the bowels of the earth. He's not even going to check my bag. Oh my gosh, it's so far away from the earth. Here's like 10 times more advanced. Is that a flying car? And flying animals too? Hey, I've never seen you here. Reveal your identity. My identity? Okay, one second. Whoa, you're from London. That's so far away. Anyway, we welcome new people here all the time. Where should I go? I wasn't given a map or anything. Everyone here is just staring at me. Creepy. Hey, my name's Aria. Hi, I'm Amara. I'm from Earth and I'm new here. Do you know where you want to live yet? 
No, I don't know how things work here. You can stay at my house. That way we can get to know each other more. Okay, sure. So, this will be your room. It's perfect. But, um, I just want to let you know that I can't pay you any rent. I don't have a job yet. You're a special person, so you don't have to pay. People here are so nice and friendly. Is that your bag? Let me pack it away. Whoa, what do you even have in this bag? What are you doing? Why are you touching my things? You're crazy. I need to get out of here. There's no way you can get out because I have this tool and it can remove those in an instant. The door is back. Hurry up. Get out. Thank you for helping me. How did you get to the bowels of the earth? I told you. I come here often. I'm here to take care of my brother. Come with me. Let me show you your house. Whoa, it's huge. Yeah, this is where you'll be living. I live just around the corner. If you need any help, just call me. Here's my number. Okay, thank you. Be single forever or get matched with someone? I don't want to be single forever because I'll never get married. So, I have to be matched. Mom, I'm going to school now, okay? Why don't you have a boyfriend? All your other friends do. I don't know, Mom, because everyone says I'm ugly. No one wants to be with me. Just calm down. I'll find you a match and you'll get married soon. No, Mom, I don't want you to find me anyone. Look at that ugly village girl. She still hasn't got a boyfriend. Yeah, no one wants to be with her. What? I'm not ugly. Hey, Amara, you look nice today. You like me? You really believe I like you? Look at me. Do you know who I am? How could I ever like someone like you? Okay, guys, as you know, next week is prom. Please make sure you bring a partner. Poor Amara. She's going to be coming alone. Yeah, there's no way she'll show up with a date to prom. Mom, can you please find me a match? I thought you said you didn't want me to. Well, I've changed my mind. I've had enough of getting bullied at school. I need a date to prom. Okay, don't worry. I'll find you someone. I know the perfect person to ask. Hello, excuse me. Are you Alex's mom? Yes, that's correct. How can I help you? I'm Amara's mom. Do you want to match our children together? Yeah, sure. Let me ask my son Alex first. Alex, I found you a girl. Her name is Amara and she wants to be your future wife. Me? Seriously? You want to match me with the neighbor's child? Her mom is so ugly. I'm sure she is too. No, her daughter's really beautiful. Just trust me. Amara, I want to introduce you to my son. Surely she's not going to accept a nerdy looking guy like me. Hello, nice to meet you. Wow, she's really beautiful. I messed up. You're very handsome. <clears throat> Did you just say handsome? Yeah, I did. So, do you want to come to prom with me? Uh, you're not embarrassed to take me? No, why would I be? Okay, I'll come. But next time you see me, I'll look much better than this. Trust me. Hey, everyone. We already told you, you can't come to prom without a partner. Aren't you ashamed of coming here alone? I do have a partner, but he's in the toilet now. You don't need to lie, Amara. Even if you have a new partner, your partner couldn't be more handsome than me. Yes, he is. In my opinion, he's the most handsome boy at prom. He's definitely not better looking than my boyfriend. Okay, even if he is, my dad works in the biggest company in town. Now that I'm thinking about it, we need more staff to clean our toilets. What do you mean? You want my partner to clean your company's toilets? Yes, exactly. You guys are too much. You're underestimating me. You know that. <sighs> Finally done. Oh yeah, where's Amara? Oh, that's her. Amara, sorry for the wait. Whoa, he's so handsome. Amara, are you okay? My friends are always mean to me. Oh, so this is your partner. I've heard so many good things about you. Yes, indeed. Why? Is Amara seriously your girlfriend? You're so handsome. What did you just say? Did you just say he's handsome? Um, no, I meant he's ugly. As you know, my dad owns a very big company. And I care because... You must not have a job, right? Because I'm feeling kind, I'll offer you one. You can clean our toilets. That's enough. Leave him alone. Relax, Amara. We're just trying to be nice to our new friend. So, what do you say? Will you take the job? I'm sorry I asked you to come to prom and put you through this trouble. It's okay. You're my future wife. Your problems are my problems. Thank you. Dad, thank you for coming. Why did you tell me to come here? I found a guy who's willing to work for our company. He said he'll clean our toilets. Which guy? He's standing right there. Wait, Alex? 
Oh, so this is your dad. How do you know each other? Dad, why are you friends with an unemployed person like him? Shh, be polite to him. You don't know who he is. Hopefully I'll get the colour of blood. That way I can be just like everyone else. Huh? Purple colour? I didn't even know purple existed. Honey, as far as I know, purple is the colour of animal blood. Animal? Yes, honey. You better change it to red. Okay, mom. I've changed it to red. Well, now you can go to school. Okay, mom. Take care, honey. Hi, guys. I'm new here. Oh, the colour of your blood is red? Yeah. Then you have to change class. Oh, why is that? The only people who can enter this class is the ones with blue blood. What? I should have changed my colour to blue instead. If I did, then I wouldn't be in this dirty class. Did you just say you changed your colour? Of course not. I'd like to order some food, please. Sorry, but if you have red blood, you can't order from this canteen. I can't? Nope, only people with blue blood can order. Actually, my colour was blue, but I changed it to red. Huh? Why did you change it? Isn't it good that you got blue? You didn't know? The king will end anyone with blue blood because he doesn't want anyone to replace him. End them? Yes. Sir, I want to ask you something. What do you want to ask? Is there any other class besides blue and red? There is one class, yes, but no one's ever entered it. It's for one person with a different coloured blood. Why hasn't anyone entered? Because that person hasn't showed up yet. Why do I suddenly have a headache? Do you want me to take you to the nurse? Yes, please. My head really hurts. Why isn't there any nurses here? The nurses barely show up for people with red blood. I feel like I'm about to have a nosebleed. Excuse me. Oh my gosh, my nose is actually bleeding. Amara, open the door. <sighs> Don't enter. Sir is sick, he needs to throw up. Hurry up. If she doesn't open the door, just break it. Yes, sir, I'll do it now. No, wait. Oh my gosh, Amara, you're purple, so you faked your color? I'm sorry, sir. Why didn't you tell me from the beginning that your color of blood is purple? Purple means that you are... It means that you're a special person who has special powers. Special powers? What are my powers? I don't feel like I have any. That's because they only work when you're angry. Angry? Yes, only people with purple blood has that How power. How do you know all of this? Hey, try to make me angry. Ouch! Did it work? No, I can't get angry at you. You're my best friend. You have to use your strength within 24 hours. Why? If you don't, you'll never meet your real parents. Real parents? So my parents right now aren't my real parents? No, they're not, because they don't have purple blood. They have red blood. Amara, I'm so scared. They said people with blue blood will get killed by the king because he doesn't want anyone replacing him. You'll be fine, don't worry. There's something I want to tell you. What do you want to tell me? If you want to know, come with me. What is it? Actually, the color of my blood is the same as yours. It's purple, but I'm trying to hide it from people. Does that mean you're my brother? Yes, you're actually my sister and I came to the school on purpose to see you. Amara, there's no point trying to look for your real parents. They're gone. Gone? What do you mean, sir? Everyone's been looking everywhere for them, but they weren't found. Where's my brother? I need to tell him something about our parents. Is this his phone? So he's the reason they disappeared? Why are you holding my phone? You're the one who made the parents disappear. Yes, it was me. They've always loved you more than me. They've spent their whole lives looking for you, so I intentionally made them disappear. You'll never see them again. Why do I suddenly feel so angry? I wonder how many mistakes I've made. Huh? Zero? That means I've never done anything wrong, right? I'll just put it on private so that my friends don't think I'm arrogant. You're the one who let my food burn in the oven, right? I told you to take it out on time. No, it wasn't me, mom. Why do you always accuse me? I know you have a lot of mistakes. That's why you put on private, right? No, I put on private because... Stop making excuses. Excuse me, sir. Am I in this class? Well, it depends. How many mistakes do you have? Um, a hundred. That means you're in the lowest class. Class D. Class D? Why is class A empty? Apparently, only one person can enter class A. It's the person with zero mistakes. They'll give that person something special. Something special? Like what? Don't worry about it, because it's definitely not you. You're the one who stole all the exam answers. No, sir, it wasn't me. She's lying. Her mistakes are private. I'm sure she just says that to not get accused. That's not true. You're all wrong. Okay, if you didn't cheat, make your mistakes on public to prove yourself. Okay, sir.
She must have a lot of mistakes. How comes it's not working? Right, you must be lying then. But sir, my mistakes are on zero. That's it. I'm giving you a detention. I'm gonna give you ten assignments. I'll collect them tomorrow. Make sure you do all of them, okay? Mom, look, the teacher gave us ten assignments. Good. Maybe you'll erase some of your mistakes since you have so many. But I don't think I've ever done anything wrong. I'm ashamed of you. Our neighbors are talking about you all the time and how bad you are. Fix yourself. Yes, Mom. Amara, what are you cooking? It's burnt. Oh, I forgot to turn off the stove. You keep making mistakes. I'm tired. But how comes my mistakes aren't increasing? Sis, why can't the number of my mistakes be published? The number of your mistakes are zero, right? How do you know? I haven't told you yet. Because mine's the same, although I do mistakes all the time. But why can't we put ours on public like everyone else? Because no one's supposed to know that we make mistakes and still have zero mistakes. If they find out about this error, they'll fix it and we'll be just like everyone else. Okay, well, good thing it didn't work because I tried putting mine on public. You tried putting yours on public? Oh no. What? It usually takes 24 hours before it goes public. Wait, what? You need to help me. How do I remove it? I don't want mine to go on public. Don't worry, I know a guy. This is the guy you know? He's a kid. Hey, don't be rude, otherwise I won't help. Okay, fine. Hey, drink this. It should reset your decision. So, did it work? Yep, all you need to do is pick private and you should be fine. Okay, now every time you get that option, just continue to press private. Like that, your number will never be public. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, if you didn't cheat, make your mistakes on public to prove yourself. She must have a lot of mistakes. How comes it's not working? Right, you must be lying then. But sir, my mistakes are on zero. That's it, I'm giving you a detention. I'm going to give you 10 assignments. I'll collect them tomorrow. Make sure you do all of them, okay? Mom, look, the teacher gave us 10 assignments. Good. Maybe you'll erase some of your mistakes since you have so many. But I don't think I've ever done anything wrong. I'm ashamed of you. Our neighbors are talking about you all the time and how bad you are. Fix yourself. Yes, Mom. Amara, what are you cooking? It's burnt. Oh, I forgot to turn off the stove. You keep making mistakes. I'm tired. But how comes my mistakes aren't increasing? Sis, why can't the number of my mistakes be published? The number of your mistakes are zero, right? How do you know? I haven't told you yet. Because mine's the same, although I do mistakes all the time. But why can't we put ours on public like everyone else? Because no one's supposed to know that we make mistakes and still have zero mistakes. If they find out about this error, they'll fix it and we'll be just like everyone else. Okay, well, good thing it didn't work because I tried putting mine on public. You tried putting yours on public? Oh no. What? It usually takes 24 hours before it goes public. Wait, what? You need to help me. How do I remove it? I don't want mine to go on public. Don't worry, I know a guy. This is the guy you know?